Atlanta's real estate market is hot. Housing prices have skyrocketed and supply is low. And it's just as tough for people who are looking to rent. Many apartment complexes have very few vacancies. News Edge reporter Alex Whitler explains. As of Wednesday, Avondale Station Apartment Property Management here in Decatur say they're renovating just one unit. It's their first vacancy they've had in several months, and housing experts say apartment complexes across Metro Atlanta are experiencing something similar. For months, we've told you the housing market is crazy right now, and like many other early 2020 changes, it's because of the pandemic. Uh, prices are up. Interest rates are extremely low from a historical standpoint. But for the most part, the chaos seemed to derive from home sales. That's changing now, too. One look at the light fixtures and the stucco on the Avondale Station Apartments on Twin Oaks Drive tells you the property isn't exactly new. It was a old, uh, probably 1940s rundown property, totally renovated it, made it a gated community, and raised the rents substantially. This place never has vacancies. And uh, I use them as a reference simply because they're indicative of the rental community in Atlanta. Real estate expert John Adams says the ability to work from home and ditch an office has sent people searching for rentals all over the country, but especially here in the Atlanta metro. You know, on a national basis, Atlanta is a real bargain in rentals. He says the average person pays $1,600 for a one-bedroom apartment in Atlanta, and the population keeps growing. Um, cultural events, um, concerts, a vibrant downtown, uh, things that Atlanta does very, very well. A new rental community named after Hank Aaron, for example, touts record-breaking leasing. Sure, it coincides with the World Series win, but Adam says that excitement in the city will only draw more people here and drive rent up even higher. If you come to my office and say, John, I have $3,000 a month in disposable income, where should I rent? I'm going to say, wait a minute. I think this is the time for us to talk about buying. Even though prices are high, uh, interest rates are so low right now that it makes it really affordable to buy a house and then lock in that housing payment at a low interest rate for many years to come. Alex Whitler, Fox 5 News. Coming up, what